hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel. I am kneeling on the floor and I have a big I saw it first haul. I'm gonna do a try on haul, so I hope the lighting's okay. Um the bag looks absolutely massive, but I actually just have five things in here. Um I have three coats and two dresses to show you. Um, they do have offers on at the moment. I will link everything down below. And just a quick reminder before I get on with the video, I do still have a giveaway open. Um, if you have a look through my recent uploads, it is in there and it is open still if you would like to enter. And that's it. I'll get on with the video. Also, just for reference, if you wanted to know, um, I am wearing a very similar coat to one that is in my haul, um, but it's a slightly different colour. And this one is from Boohoo. Um, honestly, it is the warmest coat ever. Um, I've had it for ages now, so it's got a few marks on it. I um, don't really want to wash it. <laughs> it's one of those that it will kind of probably go a bit funny in the wash. Um, but yeah, it's just like a teddy coat. It's like a cream colour. Um, but yeah, it's so warm and it is so similar to one from I Saw It First that I've got. Um, so yeah, we'll see what it's like on the try-on, but I might not keep it because I've got this one, which is so similar. Um, but yeah, it's really, really long. It's all the way down here. Um, yeah, and I just threw it on today um, just for reference also. I've just got a really random... Uh, roll neck jumper on which I've had for a long time I don't know where it's from I've had it that long and I just have some mum jeans on um and black and white bands which I basically live in um but yeah I just wanted to show as I started the video wearing these just in case you were wondering um where they were from that's that's it okay so the first item is this long line teddy coat which is like um i don't even know what color you would call that it's a little bit beigey what does it say in the tag what does it say yeah beige okay so this is the coat i was talking about which is really really similar to the one i've already got from boohoo um it clearly is a very different colour. It's like a really light brownie beige. Um, it's also very warm. It has pockets. It has little sort of like marble colour. Marble? Is that even? You know what I mean? Little wooden buttons. Plastic, whatever. Um, it's long line again, so it goes all the way down. Um, Below my knee, it's sort of like shin. It's a little bit shorter than the cream one I've got. It's actually quite nice. What do you think? It's a nice colour. They they still have the offer as well. So I ordered these uh, a couple of weeks ago. And they did um, like a flash sale of coats, £20 each of coats. And some of them are reduced like by quite a lot. Um, so this one should have been about £50, something like that, and it was down to 20 Um But they're, they're doing the, the sale at the moment still for uh, £20 coats. I think it did end and they've started it again. So if you are interested in any of the coats that I show you, and they are all in the £20 um, section on the website, um, they've got so many coats in the... In the 20 pound section but yeah let me know what you think about any of these items i'm not sure on everything um i just thought this was really similar to the one i've already got i think this one would probably be a wiser choice really color wise so that it doesn't you know show every little speck of dust or anything i don't know just for size reference if anyone wants to know um i am a, a small usually uh, this is a small slash medium, um, which I'm going to say is probably like a 8 to 10. Okay, so the next thing I've got is another coat. Again, it was in the £20 flash sale for coats. 
and it's like an aviator style um it is like teddy borg kind of i don't know if i don't know if i'm pronouncing that right what is this this is fluff but i'm gonna be really really honest when i ordered this i ordered the wrong one so they had two aviator style jackets on the website in the flash sale um one was borg all over or teddy what you know whatever whatever you want to call it and the other one kind of had like suede sort of paneling on it and that was the one that i wanted and i ordered this one by accident uh, again for size reference this is a size s so small um it's quite cute actually it's got a little belt at the bottom um typical aviator style uh yeah it's collared like this um it does have a silver zip that you can use if you would like to zip it up like this and then you know you can do the the belt at the bottom i'm just a bit sad that i got the wrong one um because i really wanted the one with the suede panel in um but yeah do a little twirl <laughs> um yeah i'm not a massive fan i mean it's cute don't get me wrong, it's cute and it's £20, pounds. It's, it is a bargain. It feels like it'd be very warm. Um, material and everything is quite good quality. Um, I think I'm just sad that I got the wrong one, so now I don't want it. Let me know down below what you think. Should I keep it? Should I send it back? Okay, the next item is a cropped little black jacket, little puffer coat. Um, I have a very similar coat, but in a completely different colour, uh, which I wear all the time. Um, it's got like a, what do you call that, a funnel neck? I don't know. It's not a hood or anything. It's cropped. It kind of like cinches in at the bottom and on the wrists, which I do really like. Um, let's try this on. Oh, it looks very cropped against my jumper. Okay, this is cute. I mean, I wouldn't wear it with what I've got on at the moment. Um, I'm not a fan of like, this situation here where my jumper is like at the bottom of the jacket if that makes sense um but so like i'd probably wear it with black to be fair you can't really you know tell but this is this is very comfy very comfy the padding's nice it's not too thick i'm, I'm always a little bit funny with padded jackets in case um they're really like too bulky um but seems all right what do you think of this one? So yeah, it's got the real, the real buttoned up little pockets here. I thought there was something in my pocket. Uh, silver hardware. Collar's not too bulky. Do you like this one? I think I'll keep this one. Um, I mean, it's very wearable. Like I said, I've got a little um, little puffer that I do wear quite often. Um, I don't know what that was, I'm sorry about that. Little jazz hands or something I was doing there. Zombie impression. Like the other two coats, this one was in the £20 flash sale um, on the website, which is open again now. So yeah, if you're in obviously interested in any of these, um, I will list it down below and yeah that's that one okay next thing i've got is a halter neck mini dress uh body corn let's say uh so it's completely backwards here 
it goes like mid thigh. Um, I'm a little bit bloated today, excuse. I'm a little kangaroo, so it's hot neck. And uh, obviously it's, it's a bit cut out here. Plain black. Um, I don't know if it's just me. Um, until I watch the video back, I'm not 100% sure, but I think it's quite see-through. Um, it was really cheap, it was on offer, so I think it was meant to be £20 and it was £10. And it was one of those things, I thought, do you know what? We'll see. I clearly don't have a very good tan here. <laughs> I don't know. I never really wear anything that's like halter neck or cut out here. Um, I feel a little bit exposed. I'm not sure. It is strangling me a little bit as well. Just for um, size reference, uh, I've got an eight. Um, it is stretchy, um, but like I said, I think it's I think it's a little bit see-through. I could probably do with some spanks as well. Uh, there's not a great deal like more I can say about it to be honest. It's, I mean, it's quite a nice material. It is stretchy. It's just quite thin. Like, you know, you can definitely see little lumps and bumps and kind of underwear lines, uh, things like that. Um, I'd probably feel quite comfortable if I could get some, you know, like high-waisted spanks um, that, uh, you know, they would eliminate the line situation. I'm just really not sure about the material and whether it's too thin. Um, because in the light, I mean, I, I can see straight through my legs, so, yeah. But yeah, let me know what you think. Okay, so, last thing I have is this dress. Um, I was saving the best till last because this was my favourite. Um, it looks better on the model than it does me. However, it is quite nice. Um, so it's sequins, um, it's got a strap which comes around here which I've just tied at the back, I'm not 100% sure I'm doing that right. Uh, it crosses over here with a little knot in the middle, it's long sleeved, it's just the, the smallest sequins ever, I hope you can see that there. Um, just little gold sequins and the dress is black underneath. It's long sleeves, I really like the sleeves how how long they are, I do like it when they go over your hand like this. Um, I did think that the sleeves might come down. Um, still potential for that, but it's sort of like cinches around here, uh, the material, which I think we'll try and keep it up. Um, it goes down to mid thigh, so it is, you know, a mini dress. Um, I'll just show you the back. Now, the only thing is, I'm slightly baffled by the situation here. Um, so I thought, with being a sequin dress, that the inside of this section here would be, you know, material, you know, like the inside of the sleeve, it would just be normal material. The inside of this section is also sequins. Um, I mean, Whose idea was that? Whose idea was that to just not have just normal material inside inside here? So, not gonna lie, it's very itchy. Um, it's very irritating. Um, again, I'm bloated. It's a little bit, you know, not really forgiving for any uh, pouches we've got going on here, but. Um, I don't know, it's not, it's not see-through anyway, like the first dress, so, you know, um, it's quite nice because it's sparkly, I mean, I was thinking I'd pair it with some black shoes or even gold shoes would be quite nice, um, I just don't understand why they've done that, it's so itchy, I just feel, oh, I mean, the shoulder's itching me slightly as well, but I can live with that. I can live with that. That's absolutely fine. I just really don't get that. 
the inside of everywhere they have made it just you know black material it's just it's got no sequins and then this bit is completely double-sided so what it looks like at the front as you can see it is exactly the same on the inside so it's just it's really irritating me but i did decide to wear it for my work still and i think i might just have to get over it again this was an offer so originally this was 40 pound and it was reduced to 18 pound um, I just had a quick look on the website and it is still £18 for this dress and it is still £10 for the black one, in case you were interested. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think down below. Um, I've come to the conclusion that it is actually the shoulders that are itching me more than anything else. Um, I'm just really baffled by it, but it's quite nice. It looks less shiny in person, I'd, I'd say. Um, it looks a lot more gold on there, but you can kind of see the sequins a lot more in real life. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think down below of all the items. That's it for my I Saw It First haul. I've got a few more videos coming up, which I'm going to film now. I've got a pretty obsessed beauty box to show you, which is exciting as it's new to me. Um, I did mention it earlier, but just to mention it again, I do still have a giveaway open at the moment on my channel. And um, that has just less than three weeks left running on it. And it's a Christmas goodie box, which I'll be giving away. And thank you for watching. If you're new here, please subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.